Hey girls, I'm back with another video. I hope you're all doing incredibly well today. In today's Abercrombie Fall Haul, I have lots of new arrivals to share with you girls. A ton of fall staple pieces that you will wear all throughout the fall season and obviously through winter as well. These are really good core staples that you can restyle over and over again. I have several new pairs of jeans to share with you guys. Abercrombie launched a ton of new jeans I'm sharing I ordered like 10 or 12 pairs. I'm not sharing everything in this haul, but I will be sharing over on my TikTok. You can find me on Instagram as well. Both places, my handle is at Brittany and Courtney. I would love for you girls to follow over there. And of course, everything will be linked down below in the description box. If you're on mobile, tap the title of this video and you will find all those links. Um, size that I ordered, if there's any other size recommendations that I have, and also um, I will list out if there's other colors because a lot of these pieces do come in several colors, so I'm sure there is one for each and every single one of you. You can also find everything in the Shop LTK app. It is a free app to download, but you can follow me over there. I post all the time um, a ton of beauty products, food stuff. Just I post in there multiple times a day. It's just kind of easy to shop in case you miss something over on Instagram stories. It's always there too. I feel like I have a lot for this haul so let's get right into it my Abercrombie fall haul part one because most likely part two and maybe even three will be coming I had ordered a ton of stuff a lot of good stuff okay the first item I want to share are these jeans they are the curve love the 90s baggy low-rise jeans I ordered them in a size 28 6 long so lower rise denim is cer certainly trending as well as baggy style denim. I know this isn't for everyone. I certainly wanted to try them. I will say these are not that low rise. They hit right below my belly button, pretty much on my belly button actually. So even though they're called a low rise, not super low rise, your hips aren't going to be hanging out, love handles, none of that will be hanging out. Um, I feel really snug and supported in these. The one thing with Abercrombie, they have the curve love fit. That is 99.9% .9 of the time of what I wear. What that means is it just gives you more room in your thighs and your hips. I think like a two inch increase of two inches and then the waist um, obviously fits you smaller. So a lot of times with jeans, I would have to like size up so it fits my thighs and butt and the waist is huge. But with these, with the curve love line, most of the time that is not the case. The waist fits me perfectly and then I have plenty of room in my hips and butt. Now with these ones being the 90s low rise, baggy fit i will say the waist wasn't as snug i think it's just because it is a little bit lower of a of a fit on the hip and i carry my weight in my hips and thighs so i feel like if i size down it would probably fit me a little bit better in the waist but then it would probably be too snug on the, the thigh so i might try it um i do like how it fits though because the back definitely comes up on your back so i'm not like worried about like it being too low back there at all just kind of has that overall baggy fit that I am looking for. Now I am 5'5 five five for reference, so I did get a long in these, and that was literally because I want it to be even baggier at the bottom. I paired it with my Nike Air Force Ones. If you guys are new here, I did a whole sneaker haul styling video here on my channel. I will link it down below in the description box, but in this video, I'm sharing my Nike Air Force One and my Beja Campo sneakers. Those are two of my favorite pairs. I am a sneaker girl, so I <laughs> the Air Force Ones with these jeans here. Now those jeans obviously come in several colors. You'll find a ton, some with rips, some without. I paired it back with this little corset tank top. Um, I got a size medium and I had ordered it in several colors. It does come in more than just this. It comes in like actual colors if you're not wanting a neutral. However, I ordered my true size medium and the straps were just too big overall. The top was a little bit big. I think I'm kind of in between a small and a medium as of lately with Abercrombie. I had ordered the medium though and the straps were just way too long, they fall off. I mean, I would probably say if you're average size, go ahead and size down on this. If you have a larger chest, you might be okay. But for me, this was just a little too loose in the strap area. So if you carry more weight in your torso area, you're probably gonna wanna stick to your true size. Maybe just get these like taken in. I mean, I think on sale I paid $15 for these. Full price, I believe they're $29. Um, so a really cute tank, seamless fabric, but just a little too big for me. Then we have this sweater dress, spaghetti strap tank uh, midi dress. It has a wonderful fit. I love the little keyhole detail here in the front. Nothing too big. I think you can definitely wear this with a blazer or a cardigan to work with booties. I would just wear something probably a little bit oversized so it doesn't show your figure as much. I mean, that's just kind of like my opinion, but it does come in several colors. I picked up the cream. It also comes in a dark brown, which I think is beautiful. Probably should have gotten that. 
um, just because I think it's really pretty for fall. But I will style cream, of course. Also comes in a beautiful orchid color. Full price, I'm gonna say the dress is maybe $70, but I definitely paid $50. One thing with Abercrombie, you guys, if it's not on sale, most likely will go on sale the following week. So just keep watch. Um, just come back to my video so you can um, have those links to shop. But really, really love this. I feel like it's a great transitional dress to wear right now with those braided little mules that I picked up from Amazon, less than $40, true to size, come in 12 plus colors. And then I threw on this Barefoot Dreams cardigan that I had shared, I've shared multiple times, got in the Nordstrom anniversary sale, got a size medium, also comes in gray, which I picked up as well as black, but such a good layering piece, so cozy. I think obviously you can just throw on booties with this in a cardigan, a hat, and you, you have like the perfect fall outfit. So definitely a dress to wear now and style again later. Moving further into the season, you could of course wear even taller boots underneath with a blazer on and um, throw on a scarf, something like that. I think it's just like a really good staple and again, comes in those two other colors. Abercrombie always has the best Henleys, even this little cardigan that I got maybe a year or two ago. Super soft Abercrombie. <laughs> Nine out of 10 times the knits that I wear are Abercrombie because they always have such good fits and they're super soft. And I think Abercrombie always does neutrals best. This top right here, I got in a size medium. It kind of has like this fuzzier feel on the inside, not too hot, definitely like a really good basic moving into fall. Buttons up the whole way in the front. You can leave it part of you can leave it unbuttoned on the top and bottom like I did. And of course, you can just fully button it. Also comes in cream and black. Full price. This is forty dollars, but I wouldn't pay any. I would not pay any more than thirty for this. To be honest, I just think because it goes on sale often enough, I would just kind of wait for it. But love this. Paired it back with jeans. Now these jeans I had picked up, they are brand new from Abercrombie. They are the Curve Love Mom High Rise, and I got them in my regular size 28.6. What I loved about these is the, the distressed detail here at the bottom of the hemline. I think that is just super cute. And I love the light wash because the one that I have has lots of buttons in the front. They're just like kind of, they're a little bit older now. I've worn the heck out of them and I feel like anytime I wear them, I can't link them for you girls. So I wanted to try like an updated option. Now I will say with these, I would have gotten the six long versus the six regular. This is what I have on is the regular length. I just like my denim a little bit longer, I'm less of an ankle. So I should have just gotten the long for them. However, and again, I'm 5'5", five five, measurements down below. However, I will say they are just more of a skinnier feel and I'm really looking for more baggy and flared, bigger jeans, wider leg jeans. I think it's just because I have enough skinny. But if you're on the hunt for a skinny option, I really, really love these. Love that light wash. No branding on the back. I just love the dye patch there. And also just to point out, of course, with skinny jeans, the whole thing on that, you guys just, I really feel strongly you should always wear what makes you feel your best and most comfortable, whether that's on trend or not. I mean, that is always the goal is just to be comfortable with what you have on. So wear what you want in short. Then Abercrombie, these are old. Um, these are like a, a waffled wide leg, wide leg lounge pant. I have them in several colors. Um, they are currently in stock in gray and I believe they have a camel color. It won't surprise me if Abercrombie releases two or three more this season, but they are so dang comfortable. I think this together is the perfect work from home outfit, lounge outfit. You know, get home, shower, and put on your comfies. Both of these will be on repeat for me this fall and winter. Satin slip dresses are on a major trend and Abercrombie has several slip dress options. So I picked up this mini one I thought would be really cute for Vegas. Has a lace trim on the whole top half. I love that. Now I ordered this in a size large, way too big in the armpits. I would definitely have to get this taken in. However, I will say if I got a medium, I think it would be more of a snug fit where I kind of like that this is just you know, tight across my chest, like, you know, fits my chest and then flares away from the body. I pair them with the silver little boots. I think, again, really cute for Vegas or a night out, something fun. This slip dress comes in two other colors, comes in like a brownish um, camel color with the contrast black lace detail. And then it also comes in a turquoise with the black lace as well. I went for all black. Now, I will say though, if you are looking for a midi length or even a longer length, more hugging to the body, there are multiple options that Abercrombie have, so be sure to check down below in the description box. I will put a couple options because they're really beautiful, and I am kind of wanting like a cream slip dress to wear under some of these big cardigans, you know, cozy cardigans for the fall season. Corsets have been trending. Now this one I picked up from Abercrombie, of course, comes in this olive color, also comes in black, also comes in cream. The cream is gorgeous. 
I mean, you really can't go wrong with any of these neutral colors. Fully functional here, you can, it's like a hook and an eye and you can just completely take it off the whole way down, um, get it on that way. So super easy and comfortable. I am wearing a medium. It's a little loose at the top. I'm not sure if I would do a small though, but it also comes with straps to make it, so you have little straps that you can attach. And then here right inside where the chest is has like a little adhesive, so it's not gonna go anywhere, especially if you sweat, it's gonna like stick to you. I just think this is a really cute option, certainly perfect for date night, but I also think this is you know appropriate for work, depending on where you work, of course. But um, you could wear this with like nice pants, heels, and then throw a blazer on over top of this. Just like a really comfortable top has boning on the side that gives it like that corset feel and then of course piping here just like really flattering on the body now these pants i think every single one of you need especially if you either go out or you work <laughs> in an office this is abercrombie's ponty pant it comes in several colors including like a camel color and i think an olive color but it has this split at the bottom i think it's just super flattering i had picked these up this is a size medium by the way i had picked these up for vegas because i think they're just like a really cute pant to throw on with like a crop top and heels but as soon as i wore them i mean that they're just so flattering they hold you in uh, I feel like gives your butt like a good lift. I really, really like them. Um, so I think that they are just like a wardrobe staple for the fall season. Now I got a size medium. They fit 12. I know I had mentioned before that there's a Revolve one that I had ordered in. Those are $178, also medium. I like them, link down below. However, when I found these full price, $70, I paid $50. I would watch for these to go on sale probably every other week. I only paid $50, so I feel like they do the kind of the same thing. These are a great option, absolutely love these. Trousers are majorly trending for the fall season, and especially when they are satined as well. So satin trouser, I had picked these ones up. They do come in several colors, including a dark brown, which I think are gorgeous. I picked up this one in this khaki color. Now, I did get a size large and they're just way too big in the waist you guys I mean massive probably two or three inches that have to get taken in on the waist however throughout the hips and the butt I do think they fit pretty nicely I'm gonna order a medium just to try however I think it might be like too tight or hit weird on my butt and thighs might show some cellulite that I don't love of course so I'm thinking the large will probably be the fit I would just have to get the waist taken in which no surprise to me I typically have to get my waist taken in um, especially if I kind of go up a size in pants just because I have a smaller waist and need more room in my hips and butt and thigh. The corset that I just shared with you, the satin corset, that would be super cute. A very Pinteresty outfit would be to wear the satin corset strapless top with these in like Air Force Ones or Nike Dunks. Um, I feel like that is just super trendy and cute. Now I think for most of you, if you wear this with like a blouse and little heels, perfect for date night. Um, probably this in a blazer. A body suit with the blazer over on top of this just a lot of options i think these are really cute but just a little too big in the waist again i think these kind of trousers are certainly a fall staple kind of just something to switch it up from just wearing jeans again perfect for date night or of course if you work in the office i think you'll just be able to restyle these over and over again i picked up two body suits the other one is a scoop neck fits really well got a size medium that I'll link it down below but this one I love because it has a functional zipper and you can see it goes pretty dang low I love that it's functional though just because you can like kind of decide depending on what you're doing night out or whatever um, or wearing as a bodysuit under a blazer or you know something for work you can obviously zip it up it comes in several colors black cream and I believe one other color really really like this wearing medium has the snap closure here in the bottom now I just ordered these jeans in because I want to find like a lighter wash blue denim, kind of similar to my Levi's. If you guys have seen that, I've shared my denim collection here on my channel. I'll link that down below. But kind of has like this blue wash worn 90s look, so I love that. These are the Curve Love the 90s Relax Jean High Rise. I ordered size 28.6 regular. I believe I also ordered these in a long or like at least a different color. I'll have to decide on that, but I do really, really love how these look especially with those little braided heels i'll link something similar down below because those are a little bit old lots of options out there though but i really do like how these look for that now if you want them a little bit baggier if i want them a little bit baggier for maybe sneakers then i would definitely get the long so i kind of have to make that choice i mean i think these with sneakers will look cute too i just kind of like that folded over baggy look with a longer jean um, but really really love the wash of these the fit overall is just really nice i think it's very flattering on the hips very smooth on the hips like that line so if you haven't tried jeans in a while from abercrombie i definitely recommend these again these are the curved love the 90s relaxed jean 
I would say true to size, I'm always a 28 six in curve love. Okay, girls, so that's it for today's Abercrombie Fall Haul Part 1. Please note if I didn't mention anything, if I didn't say something, it is all linked down below in the description box. So I know I had shared a flannel tied around my waist. That's an old one from Target. Target has great $22 flannels. Again, my favorites are linked down below. I will always have everything linked down below in the description box for you guys. If you need anything else, of course, leave me a comment down below and I will get back to you. Please do hit the subscribe button. It really helps me as I try to grow here on YouTube. Also find me over on TikTok, Instagram, and the Shop LTK app. Again, very easy to find me. Just search my name, Brittany and Courtney. I'm kind of like, you know, on all of that. So would love for you to join me elsewhere. Thank you so much for watching today's video, and I hope to see you really soon in my next video.